Hi everyone, Marty Angel here once again with words of wisdom to help you grow and prosper. Today I share how yoga and the art of listening go hand in hand. T.S. Little often says that yoga is the art of listening. In yoga, there is a little focus on inward listening to your body during the practice of asana. You listen to the rhythm of your own breath and the process of listening or watching your thoughts as they arise and pass during the practice of meditation and yoga. In this quote by Suzuki that says, when you listen to someone, you should give up all your preconceived ideas and your subjective opinions. You should just listen to him, just observe what his way is, put very little emphasis on right, wrong, good or bad, just seeing how things are with him and accept them. Usually, when you listen to someone's statement, you hear it as a kind of echo of yourself. You are actually listening to your own opinion. If it agrees with your opinion, you'll accept it. But if it doesn't, you'll reject it. Or you may not even hear it. We can all learn a lot about ourselves and our listening style when we practice yoga asana. We begin to practice listening. When we are in asana, each pose is a tool of observation. And that's important. When you practice asana, you may also become aware of incongruencies between your left and your right sides of your body, possibly due to the, your work or habitual holding patterns. This is a lesson in learning to listen without judgment because we just observed how the body is feeling, moving and behaving. We practice intently listening to what our body is telling us. The art of listening can be enhanced as well by a meditation practice. Meditation is a constant, constant process of dropping theories, opinions, hopes about what the practice holds and returning to the bare reality of the sound of our breath, posture, and what is happening in the external world. Are the birds chirping? Is the candle flickering? What can I hear that's outside myself? To listen without comment gives us a glimpse of reality beyond our internal conversation that is where we find the quieter place inside ourselves. That is where insight arises. Yoga and the art of listening go hand in hand. Yoga teaches us to listen with the intent to understand and the art of listening enhances our yoga practice. So if you want to be a better listener, perhaps starting a yoga practice is where it will help you achieve this goal. This is Marty Angel signing off. I hope you found value in this and if you did, please leave a comment below. I would love to hear from you. Now, please join me in gratitude. I am thankful for everything I have, for all that I am, and all that I'm about to become. Have a beautiful day, everybody. Namaste.